And of course, this week we're continuing, actually we're gonna conclude uh, the Catholic Charities Drive for this part, it actually goes to the end of June, but these two weekends are the most important part for our parish, so there'll be volunteers in the community room after all of the masses to receive your pledges or your donations, or you can do it online, and I think they will put that address up on our screen for Catholic Charities of Western New York. And even if you're not part of our diocesan uh, parish here, uh, you, could, you could support this wonderful work of Catholic Charities that reaches out to 125,000 people in Western New York every year. So many of our sisters and brothers are in such such serious need. So whatever you can do, it'll be put to good use. And then of course we have our Holy Week services coming up. Uh, we have Holy Thursday at 7 p.m., Good Friday at 2 p.m., the Easter Vigil on Holy Saturday night at 8 p.m., and Sunday, Easter Sunday morning masses at 8.30, 10 and 11.30 a.m. There will not be an Easter Sunday night mass at 7 p.m. We usually have that Sunday night mass with the university students, but not on Easter. So again, go on our website, or I think we'll put those times up on the screen, and please join us, and we will be recording a mass for Easter, and that's going to be going up, I think, uh, at 6 o'clock in the morning on Easter Sunday, I think is when it's scheduled to play, so it doesn't interfere with the Easter vigil. And we are in the process of installing uh, the right kind of equipment so that we can live stream services. Now, whether they're going to be ready for the Triduum for Holy Thursday, Good Friday, and Easter Vigil, we don't know. But check our website, stjosephbuffalo.org, and we might be up and running, and you might see some of our live stream masses. But if not, we'll have our Easter Mass on, on Easter Sunday at 6 a.m. So in the meantime, have a blessed Holy Week. God bless you. Stay well and stay safe.